Next time you're getting rainbow. Oh yeah, I have to. Yeah, I thought you was gonna get like I don't know why I didn't get rainbow. Oh, I didn't know that was an option. Oh, I'm sorry. Y'all, the second worst thing is happening to me today. And the first worst thing I may ask is ordering some dang chicken fingers and not getting no ketchup with it. Did it just happen? No. But is that just the worst thing that ever happened to me in my life? Yes! Like, how could you possibly deliver my chicken fingers with no ketchup? Today, your girl is getting, drum roll please, bow! I'm getting braces at my big ass Annie's. Yes! And y'all probably wondering, Gabby, your teeth are straight, uh, right? No! Well, actually, yeah, it is. But that's not the reason. I've had braces for three years when I was younger in middle school, y'all. I had braces from sixth grade to eighth grade. Technically, that's two year and a half years, but y'all, I had braces for three, almost three years, and now I need them again. Y'all probably like, why Gabby and Tifa's like real straight? I'm confused. I'm confused too. So, when I had my braces when I was younger, sixth grade, I was like, very young, I don't remember what the age was, but if you say age, I was younger because y'all, I was always younger in my class by like a year, so think a, a year younger than you was in sixth grade, right? So, I went to this doctor named Dr. Solo. It's Dr. Solo, count your days. This man did not care, like, I literally had gaps all over y'all, gaps. You know what, let me just find a picture because my teeth, I mean, they were precious. I was a child, so like, don't be judging no child. I just went to the front of my camera roll well, the beginning, why is there a picture of um Tina? What's her name? I forget this woman's name. Y'all, who is this again? Nia Long. Why is there a picture of her talking about some December 1969? This is me and my cousin and my sister. I'm all the way right here. Y'all see them gaps? It's a like gap between all my teeth. Like I just had gaps. Like it looked like I had um Apple wall chargers in my mouth. Just boom. One, two. Three. That being said, I went to my doctor, got some braces. I also have an overbite. Do y'all see how deep, like, y'all know what an overbite is, right? This underbite, that I, like, I literally can't do that because it hurts my jaw. But this overbite, it's, oh, it's too far over your um, bottom teeth, look. So, I had, y'all probably like, wait, why didn't they fix that? So, I literally had the braces that got my teeth straight. After my teeth were straight with the braces, I ended up having to get rubber bands from here to here. You know when people do the rubber bands to pull your jaw back so that your teeth is not like overbite. It was like supposed to go like this. But like it was supposed to be tight like this, like this. You know what I'm saying? I had the rubber bands for like a year, took them off, they took them off. My overbite was not fixed whatsoever. And I'm like, Dr. Solo, like, hey, I know my gaps are fixed, but I still have overbite. He's like, no, you don't. I'm like, yes, I do. He's like, no, you don't. But look, didn't fix it at all. So then when I was 19, mind you, I'm 23 now. When I was 19, this tooth hurt it really bad, y'all. And I'm like, I know I have a cavity. Went to Dr. Solo after my braces were off, like long after my braces were off. And I'm like, Dr. Solo, I have a cavity. He's like, no, you don't. You just brush you hard. I'm like, no, I really feel like I have a cavity. So whenever I brush one of the bristles get right here, I'll be like, ow! He'd be like, cap. I'm like, how you gonna tell me cap? You a whole dentist, you know what I'm saying? Turns out I had a cavity since I was 19, 18, 19, and I found out last week, I'm 23, y'all. Cause this doctor wanted to sit in my face and tell me I never had a cavity. Turns out I had two cavities because my top my top jaw is so far down, it's rubbing against my teeth, it's rubbing against my bottom teeth and creating cavities. And they're not holes, they're like lines. Cause my whole tooth is sitting up against my bottom teeth and just rubbing against them for the past like five years. I'm about to go get my braces. My appointment is at 11 o'clock. It is 9.33. My sister really wants to come with me so I'm about to pick her ass up. And then we gonna see what's up. I'm nervous. Brace face. Don't wanna talk about a teenage. And then, and then, and then, uh, brace face. Y'all ever seen that drum before? Yo, I can finally relate to my show. Please watch Brace Face on YouTube, y'all. It's so funny. So the outfit of the day is my Amazon orange bag, my emotional therapy hat. Y'all know I was gonna put y'all on. Hello Black Child, my brand acid wash set called the Homegirl set. And then I got the match of pants. Wait, hold on, the logo's on the side. I got the match of pants. Ugh, I can't even see the logo, hold on. 
I got the magic pants. And then I got me some on my Uggs that my boyfriend got me. And then here goes Twyla. Say hey, girl. Say hey, girl. How you doing? Oh, I got her a new harness yesterday. Y'all, if your dog pulls, please get them this harness. It's called, hold up, get up, baby girl. Ooh, she don't want to get up. It's called J, J, J Julius Dash K9. Y'all, this dog pull you like no other. She walked me. Yeah, don't look at me on the side like that. She walked me. And I got her this harness, y'all. It was like $50. And this is not sponsored, I promise. But I'm at the pet store yesterday. I'm like, you know what? I need a new harness. I've been using her collar and I started to feel bad. So I'm like, I don't want to keep pulling on her neck. Ouch. Ouch. So I ended up getting her a harness. Y'all, she does not pull no more. I don't know what it is about this harness. It don't got no prongs in there or nothing. No, no sharp shit. So I don't know what it is about the harness, but my girl just walked, man. And I'm really, really, really... <laughs> I'm really sick right now because my dad insurance only covered my braces one time. Like once you get braces, you're not covered no more. Why well, I gotta pay five thousand dollars for these shits, y'all? They're like, oh, it's only a whopping one hundred eighty a month. Because my mama already told me I gotta start paying my own car insurance in February. And we not speaking right now. Cause why would she ever do that? Why would you ever do something like that? Like, that on and the car insurance like two fifty. They on top of one eighty a month. Damn near four hundred. Hello. Okay. Let's head to get to my little sister. I'm nervous. I'm no. I'm gonna be cute and she like hey. I'm gonna be like there all the time. Take my pictures like mouth always open. I'm be like this. You just be like this. I'm gonna be like this. I'm here waiting for my little sis. Y'all, I'm praying to let me record because I know some dentists are weird, but I have a feeling they are. But, like, if I'm paying $5,000, you better let me record my own mouth. You're not even going to be in it. And the only reason you won't let me record is you're going to mess my braces up. You're going to mess my braces up? That's what I'm saying. Like, there's no reason to not let me record if I'm getting a whole shebang done and I'm paying 5 k ah. <laughs> And I asked to record my own face, and y'all say, no, I'm going to walk out. I'm serious. Like, if y'all don't let me record my own face, that's crazy. Oh, the dentist was, no, no funny shit, but the dentist was picking apart my smile. He was like, smile for me real big. I was like, he was like bigger. I was like, he was like, see, you have a very gummy smile. I'm like, don't everybody have a gummy smile if you make me smile? I don't even smile like that. It's how I smile. Okay. He was like, no, wider. Why? I said, he like, see, I can see gums. And I'm like, yo, at this point, I feel like they're trying to take my money. Like, I don't think I need braces that bad. The overbite is overdoing it, though. But he was picking me apart like gummy smile, yo, crooked teeth, gaps in the teeth. He talk about some, oh, overbite. I'm like, damn. So then after my consultation, I started feeling a little insecure. A little insecure, I'm not gonna lie. Like, I be smiling like this now. Oh, yeah, this is what I'm telling you. So they were like, oh, so they're like, you have a gummy smile. So we gotta screw screws in the top of your mouth right here. And I'm like, excuse me? He was like, oh, no, how rubber bands go like that? Yours need to go like this. And I'm like, I'm going to talk to him today. I'm not getting that. I'm sorry. You lost me with that one. I'm all the other side of town with that one. You can't even find me with that. I was like, excuse me? He's like, yeah, we're going to have to screw a screws in the top of your gums to get... What? Sorry. Sorry. Not doing it. How about I screw screws on top of your mouth? Say hi, sister. Hi. I'm excited. Um, I have a feeling they're going to let me record, but if they don't, that's going to be real weird. <sighs> we'll see. It depends on the doctor. But like, it's my mouth. What? I'm gonna just pull it out while I'm in there, and they, what are they gonna say? Oh no! Yeah. I'm gonna be like, I'm documenting my journey. Okay. They're not gonna say no, please. We made it to the dentist office. I'm about to walk in, do paperwork. That I gotta take X-rays, I think. And then yeah, don't don't they need to take a mold um for for um your teeth or no? They didn't do anything. All they did was talk to me. Like, they didn't take no mold. Maybe that's for the retainer. After, I don't yeah. know. But yeah, we're about to walk in, do paperwork, do what they got to do, and then I'm going to get my braces. This is my teeth before. Don't forget. And then y'all see. <laughs> and then y'all see after. They look good. He picked me yeah. apart. He's lying. I think they're scammers. Maybe they're not scammers, but I feel like. They're not he scammers. Some, guess how long he going to say I need my braces for? Took about some two years. I said, for an overbite? Two years was not to fix my overbite, huh? I don't know about all that. 
Yeah. He, he told myself, they just want me to pay. I know who had their braces on since preschool. Scammers. Wait, what? <laughs> yes, this one girl had her braces off his preschool. I'm like, yo, uh, that's girl, her teeth was straight before, out the womb. She told me, I had my braces since yeah. I was two. I said this. We're in here, and my stomach's starting to hurt because I'm nervous. Does your stomach start to hurt when you're nervous? You see, I'm trying to watch Family Feud. Ooh. the wrong vlog because i just came back with a mullet but i promise you this is still the braces vlog all right i woke up this morning in a mood where i was like i want business up front and party in the back it was like nine o'clock in the morning i'm like i need to switch to i'm gonna make some shake so i went to the hair store and got me a mullet <laughs> <laughs> but um yeah i got a mullet but all right let me talk to y'all so the braces look like this and i was so mad because at my appointment they well when i wanted to go bite down Mind you, my appointment was like two days ago, y'all. I've been slacking, but girl, we still gonna continue the vlog. We got somewhere to go today. We gonna still be good. I had to get bumpers on the back of my teeth. That's why I feel like I have a, a slur, a, um, a lisp. But look, if y'all can see, I don't know. Uh, uh. Basically, my overbite was so severe, which is weird because when I had braces the first time when I was like 13... I ain't never had to get this, but they put that in the back of my mouth because they was like, your overbite is so severe that um your top teeth will break your bottom brackets if you bit down because when i was biting down so so during the appointment when i was biting down like this it was hitting the bottom bracket so they put that there so it wouldn't hit and also to correct my overbite for a slightly before they actually go in and like really correct it i told you i gotta get screws in my mouth like but that's not to, that wasn't yesterday i thought it was yesterday but it's not till like a few like maybe a year from now but um yeah i could barely talk my teeth are a little bit sore only this one and it was weird because i didn't have no gaps in my mouth except the, this gap and this gap because my teeth is too small right here they can never really close them to gaps because my teeth are too small like they will never fill in that space so after i get my braces off i'm gonna have to get two veneers but i got a gap right here now hold on let me see if i can focus this y'all hold on look y'all see that that was not there before and then when i had braces when i was younger i had to get my gums cut because my like i'm very sensitive to like metals and like even jewelry like i'm very sensitive to stuff like that um my gums already started swelling up like i can barely see my teeth up top here and a top here like it was way more teeth shown before up here and up here so what i'm gonna do today is y'all we gonna go to tarjay and get me a, a toothpick i mean a, a water pick which i wanted a pink one from amazon but i really can't wait so i'm gonna get one from, from target and then i'm gonna get this mouthwash she recommended and yeah there's a few things off of amazon i still do need to get but that's gonna be i'm not gonna show y'all in this vlog because it's gonna take like a couple days but yeah what else it hurts to eat i'm eating this donut it's over here i'm gonna show y'all what it look like to eat hold on this donut she over there y'all see her the donut it hurts to eat i can't even bite down all the way because of this stupid ah uh, 
them. I can barely bite. So I'm gonna show you how I look like to eat. Um, all right. So look, y'all see, I cannot. My back teeth are not connecting. Y'all see that face? So when I what's that? Oh, so when I chew, like it really feels like. I'm not really true enough, and I gotta swallow my food basically whole. Like at this point, what's the point of teeth? Uh uh. Hold up. Ooh. Like it's not connecting. My teeth are not doing the job. No, no. But let's go head to Target, y'all. Get me what I need. Come back. I'm going to show you the stuff they gave me for aftercare. I'm going to show you how I brush my teeth. I'm going to give. We're going to do a whole nine. But can I gossip with y'all real quick? I got some tea. And I really want to tell you. So let's get comfortable for a moment. Because I really, y'all know, like, even though, so if you're new to this channel, the vlog might say, oh, this is going to be about braces. But I'm going to tell y'all about the tea down the hall. I'm going to tell you what's going on. With, with somebody, okay? Because, look, it's not my business, but it's my business to tell. Back, like, three months ago, right, there was this boy. If you don't care for this and just want to see the braces, girl, you better stay. <laughs> but anyway, because this, this channel was never given us about one topic of video. Absolutely not. I'm going to tell you what I got to tell y'all. So, basically what happened... Ooh, hold up. He's eating. So, oh, let me take these off so I can really talk to y'all. But what had happened was, uh, three months ago, right, I saw this guy I went to high school with. And I told my life this story, and I was like, I don't want to seem like I'm better than anybody or I'm above anybody. But I'm sure at this apartment complex I'm at, people look at me like I'm crazy and be wondering how I can afford my apartment because the people here are very stuck up. And, like, if you see somebody walking in the neighborhood, you can tell by their vibe they definitely live at this apartment building. Like, they def they definitely live here. You can, The people here are just very, like, bougie, stuck up, sticking their butt, like, all that. So when I saw this guy I knew here, I'm like, oh, shit. I'm like, wait, you live here? Like, And I didn't say it like that, but in my head, I'm like, oh, okay, not, that's cool. Like, and, and I always like, what's his job? Uh-oh. Oh, he moved up like i know that's right but whatever so when i saw him i was like oh shit but so i was like oh hey like how you, well he he was a like, gabby is that you i'm like yeah i was thinking how you look familiar we went to high school together he like yeah da, da, da. i'm like all right how you been when you moved in he, like, oh. he was like oh i moved in a month ago but we already about to move out because they trying to evict me they on some weird stuff mind you mm, the only reason to ever get evicted is if you're not paying your rent so, they definitely not on some weird stuff. You just not paying your rent. And I was like, oh, I'm sorry. He like, no, it's no problem. I'm like, okay. And he was let me get your number. I'm like, all right, here's my number. He like, you smoke? I'm like, no. And I see him stop typing my number in his phone. I'm like, oh, period. Okay, I guess he just wanted to. Mind you, girl, he he one of the girls. So, you don't got to worry about me, like, smoking with some random stranger. Like, and I have a boyfriend. Trust. He's one of the girls. So, it wasn't like I was just like, oh, giving him my number or nothing. But, um, so, I haven't seen him since then. And he told me I live down a hall all the way down to the left. I'm like, okay, cool. We on the same floor in the same hallway. Cool. So, literally a couple weeks ago, which was three months, I walked past his apartment and it said, oh, $30,000. He only was here for three months, y'all. He said he owed $30,000. I'm like, what? His apartment is a three bedroom. The three bedrooms here run from 8K to t to 10K. So he must have had the nice three bedroom. So he must so three months, ten thousand dollars a month, that's 30k. He was not paying rent the whole time he was here. I'm like, yo, that's what's his name, Crib? I'm like, oh my god, that's so crazy. So last week I'm going downstairs to get me a package from the package room. Boom, walking down the hallway. Y'all. I smell a smell I have never smelled before. And when people say dead body smell like something you ain't never smelled before, it smelled like a dead body. Something I've never smelled before. And I'm like, oh my God, what is that foul smell? That it really smelled like somebody died. Like, what is that stench? I'm like, oh my God, like this is, oh my God. Like, my nose felt like my hairs have fell out of it. Like, it, I'm not trying to be funny right now. It really smelled so foul. 
like something I've never smelled. I call it the front desk, not to be that person, but I'm like, look, I know I'm the only one that smelled this. And I had my boyfriend walk down the hall. I'm like, go ahead, walk down the hall. You gonna smell something you ain't never smelled before. He walked down there and he smelled something you never smelled before. I called the front desk. I'm like, hey, concierge, this is Gabby. I'm just calling because it's just a very foul, stanky smell coming down the hall and it's stinking up the whole hallway. They like, oh my God, you're like the 10th person that called today. It must be really bad. Let me get someone up there. Da -da -da. They got someone up there. The smell was going two days later. But tell me how yesterday... My boyfriend came to visit, and he like, did you see down the hall? I'm like, no. Nah. We look down the hall. It's like four, like three trash bins full of flooring with all these brown stains on them. I'm like, uh-uh. Like, what is that? Like, I hope it's not what I think it is. I'm sure it's not. But they have covered up a murder here. Look, you didn't hear it from me, y'all. But they have. I wasn't living here. This was like seven years ago. But you can't find it nowhere in the news. But my dad, he a cop. So he be knowing the tea. And he was like, yeah, somebody died here. I'm like, what? He like, yeah. So like, well, don't say you heard it from me. I'm like, look, I won't tell you. I won't tell nobody I heard it from you. Except y'all. Okay. <laughs> so... I'm gonna look at someone did die. They got money. They got good lawyers to cover it up. But no, that's not what happened. What I think happened is that they was real bitter. They got kicked out. And then they probably put a bunch of raw meat, left they knocked their fridge over something. Something left it on the floor and had it rot. And that's the day that I smelled that stench was when it started really stink. That was my little story time, but I also did a little story time so I can get um training for my braces because I've been trying to talk more so that I get used to them. Could y'all hear a lisp? I'm getting a little bit better. <laughs> Let's go to Target. I don't know if I should go to Target or Walmart. I think I'm going to do Target. And then we're going to go shopping for some stuff I need. The specific toothpaste and then the water pick. You know, and then we're going to go back and use Come back and use it. Oh, I just registered my dog as a therapy dog. And I'm so excited. Because my new apartment was talking about some, I'm moving out in February. They're talking about some, oh yeah, she $300 deposit, $50 a month. I said, oh, uh-uh. She a therapy dog, so I just had registered her. I'm about to submit my little papers. Don't tell nobody I told y'all. <laughs> Target. I don't know what I'm going to do. Target. 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 So, the floss is right here. First, alright, they got the, wait, what, why are they so, I look at the cheap ones. Dental picks, 100 count, what's, how many count is this? 16. I'm gonna get this one, because I got 100 in them. And then, let's see what else I need. Them little loops, I don't know if they got in here though. Other floss, and the, oh, yeah, but why is $7? Super floss. All right, look, braces. Super floss. Four nineteen. Look, we on a budget. So I'm gonna get that one. My dentist said to make my gums not as swollen. I gotta get the Crest. Look, y'all. This is what we trying to look for right now. The Crest detoxify and restore toothpaste. I whenever I come to the black neighborhood, they lock everything up. Why y'all lock y'all toothpaste up? They be hating on us. So I gotta call somebody to come get it. Oh, found it. Here we go. Locked up. So I gotta press use the help button for assistance. Oh, here we go. Look. That's a shame, cause white people be stealing just as much as black people. And if you white, look at me and tell me y'all don't be stealing. Mm. Y'all be no, y'all be robbing banks for like millions of dollars. That's what y'all be doing. <laughs> like you ever seen a heist? What color they be? Look, y'all be taking millions. We be taking toothpaste. Yeah. And the water picks is right here, so I'm gonna need assistance with that too. That's not cute. I wish they had a pink one. Can you unlock this for me, please? This is cute. Okay, thank you. I pressed this button like five times. Uh, a guest needs a key in A36. I need both actually. Can you unlock okay. this? Which one is $40 for Oh, this one. Yeah, okay. It is 40 Thank you. Why was my total um, $80? But I just realized when my total comes to that much money, I'm like, wait, it was kind of redundant for me to get floss and a water pick. 
I kept calling it a toothpick, but it definitely was redundant. Like, I shouldn't have never gotten no floss. But it was only $5, but still. I guess I could use it on, like, a vacation if I don't want to lug the whole water pick with me or whatever. Ow, my tooth hurt. Y'all, I'm getting more comfortable walking around with the camera. <laughs> because who gonna check me? Nobody. And people don't really care about it. And, and honestly, people don't care about you. If you really think about it, like, everyone's just here to do their own business and get out. Like, nobody's really like, oh my god, look at her vlogging. Like, nobody give up about that. And if they do, they'll forget in, like, 20 seconds. Because if you really think about it, if they hating on you because you vlogging, they got other shit going on. Because, like, if you're a hater, you obviously don't, like, you're not satisfied with your own life. So by the time they, like, look at you crazy, they already thinking about all the bad stuff going on in their life anyway. Like, bills not paid, baby dad don't care, like, you know. Want, want a bag, can't get it, like. So by the time they're like, oh my God, look at her vlog. They're already thinking about baby dad. They're already thinking about bills not paid, you know what I'm saying? So if that's if that's the case, like why would y'all care about vlogging in public? You know what I'm saying? Mole it, fire. Girl, this look everything. I'm eating it up. And one thing about me, I stand on, I mean business. Look at this mole, y'all. I look like I mean business, but watch her. Oh, she created a party. I'm like this, look. Oh, she she bought them coins. She me oh, she had a party. Look. Oh my god, look. She run she owned three business. Oh, and she party after work. Look. Oh my god, she the CEO. Oh, and she's life of the party. Damn. Look. Look. Oh my god, she's so stuck up. Oh my wait, hold on. She kinda down to earth though. Look. Y'all look this this hair mean a lot of different things. Y'all better get you a mullet. Oh, and everything I bought, I bought today at Tarjay, I'm going to put on my storefront. So make sure you go to my bio. If y'all go to my actual channel and, like, go to my channel and look up, it'll be like, oh, link plus one or plus two. Click the link, and then you can buy what I just bought in a store. And then it give me a little bit of coin, too. Look. Look, I mean business. Okay, y'all, so I'm back home, and I got all my little Target stuff, and I'll try everything out right now. So first, what I'm going to do... Is try this toothpaste gum detoxify. That's what the doctor dentist recommended because he said if your gum is swollen, use a little gum detoxify. Usually, I use this Col Colgate. Is that how you say? Yeah, Colgate baking soda. I've been using this since I was a kid. And one thing about me, tooting for certain, my breath don't be smelling right unless I use this. Like, I hate going to somebody's house and I leave my toothpaste. I'm like, can I use your toothpaste? And the toothpaste got little cute little glitter or it's blue my breath still gonna be stink so that's why i use this but unfortunately this is i gotta use this so we're gonna see how this works i don't know something about my breath me baking so good but mm. and this toothpaste was like nine dollars girl i could have found that cheaper on amazon hello storefront if you want to go on my storefront and if it don't electrocute me then i know it's not gonna work oh hold on i just rinsed it oh, girl i just Lost two dollars with the toothpaste. We'll go back in. It's real, like it don't stick. It don't got no traction. It's like gummy. Tommy, this toothpaste is gummy. No. Uh uh. Don't get that toothpaste unless you want to die. Next, I'm going to go in with this little dental pig. I mean, I guess this is a redundant too because technically I already have the water pig. I'm not using this. I'm going to use my water pig. I never used it before. Water pig flosser, cordless, rechargeable. Um, I don't know. Look. See, this is the one I got, y'all. Look. It's going to be on my storefront. The toothpaste isn't though because that was the nastiest shit I've ever tasted in my life. It's the texture, like the texture was off, like bad. They got all, they got like four pieces. So I got this piece. Look, this piece here. I guess the yeah, on and off button. I guess it's how you charge it. And then it come with this piece. I guess this is where you put the water for the water pick part. Hold up. So one here to charge, I guess, like this. Hold on, how do I put this on here? Hold on, y'all. And then it come with these two picks. I'm gonna use the dark one first. This. So 
So I'm gonna put this joint in here. There it go, look. Mm. Oh my God. The sound is horrifying. Listen to this, y'all. So I guess I gotta put that in my mouth. Who calling? Oh, I can call her after. Look, my sister called me. So now we're gonna use the pig. I'm scared. So that felt like I was getting waterboarded. Lastly, we're gonna go in with this Thermo Breath. And the only reason I got this was because my sister used to have this all the time when she had her braces and she always had this in the bathroom. And then my boyfriend also said he used this too. So I picked some up. They have a, green, a blue one and a pink one. I chose pink because I almost like mint. And this is sparkling mint. So it sounded good. So I'm gonna go ahead and use that. Oh, I didn't show y'all the um, little kit they gave me. So they did give me this little starter kit. And it came with floss, little dental floss. It is mm, wax. So like, if your braces ever poking you, you could just like take some wax, ball it up, and put it over the bracket. It really works. Like I'm about to do that right now. It came with a travel size toothbrush a timer because you gotta brush your teeth for two minutes for three times a day that's it basically i don't know but yeah um that's it i'm excited to see how my teeth gonna come out within the next two years this is an expensive process because insurance is not covering me <laughs> but it's okay girl i gotta pay 180 a month boo lame corny but it's all right it's gonna be worth it in the end yeah all right Catch me in my next vlog. Make sure you like, subscribe, comment, and go follow me on Instagram at Black Child Diaries and Local Black Child.